Hello, this is Sausage Fingers, and welcome back to Space Engineers. Okay, so we've got our little base set up, but I have made a major boo-boo. Right, when you first start off in the game, ice is life. There seems to be far fewer, yeah, that's the word, far fewer ice lakes than there was before. Now, ice is your fuel, it is life. So to that end, I'm gonna move my whole base over to that lake there. That is what I'm gonna to do today. You need all of your vehicles before you get into space are powered by hydrogen and the hydrogen you get from the ice. Now, I would have to build either ferry that backwards and forwards to my base or I would have to build a vehicle to ferry that backwards and forwards to my base. I don't want to do that. I would rather ferry my base there once and then carry on from there. Also, a massive top tip. If you're playing in single player on the default settings, if I was to lay a brick here, i.e. you spend two hours building a base but it has no power or no antenna missing when you log back on next time the chances are it will be gone so space engineers will think it's scrap basically you'll think it's trash so if you're going to build a base the first thing you put on it is either an antenna which you won't be able to do because you haven't unlocked them yet or just stick a wind turbine or a solar panel on it and that will stop lord clang from getting rid of your base from doing the cleanup, as it were. I wish I'd have known that a lot earlier. I've lost some stuff, yeah. So to that end, let's go and move base. Mm, base movie. Choppy, choppy. Now this is going to save a lot of time later and it will give us a really nice smooth flat area to build on as well i.e massive great big spaceships and stuff everybody likes a massive great big spaceship and stuff i'm not sure what way to roll with this i.e how to get into space whether to Ooh. i'm not even going to build a base i'm going to build a spaceship we don't even know if this little thing's going to work yet but I am going to turn this straight into a ship. Yes, everybody builds a base. But we are going to build a mobile base. Yes, I still, in essence, need the basics. Look how flat this is. It is smooth as baby's bum. And this is fuel for years. This, you will never drill this lake out. Never in a million years. Well... <laughs> I bet some of you would put that to the test, but I am going to dig here, or base here, yeah it's flat, we'll go in the middle a little bit, we'll go back here, we'll go back here, we'll put down some blocks, bosh, 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 and I'm going to stick a wind turbine straight on that, I'm not worried about my other base disappearing, in fact I need to build up, don't I, two, three, four five six i'm gonna go seven here make it a little bit higher still pop this in yeah now what else do i need i have bought enough with me to build an assembler so i'm gonna get that knocked up This is just like my temporary hard standing, if you like. We can move all this afterwards. You get back, if I, you get back everything pretty much one for one. Um, apart from batteries, you don't get the power cell. If you grind stuff down, you don't get the power cells back, I've noticed. So, assembler, is it five? No, that's a basic assembler. We want the grown up assembler this time. Right, so that's an assembler in. Assemblers are good. They assemble stuff. I can put that in there, and that in there, and that in there. I could, oh, I thought I could put scrap in there. No, I put that in a refinery, don't I? I can put all of that in there. So I've got more room to carry the things over. Yes, I'm going to drop my scrap on the floor. It's going to take a few runs to get this ferried over, but we've got to do it, haven't we? We've got to do it. Set up home properly the first time. Is that on there? That's on there. That's attached. We could always move this at a later date. That's going to be a bit quicker, 
we ain't got enough steel plate on us, but, you know. Look at my little legs flapping about. Looks like we're going back. Da, 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 da. Hello, thing. Where's the button? There it is. Oh, nothing. Right, let's finish this little bad boy off. So now I've got a grown-up refinery. And because it's attached to this, I can go into my assembler. Press here. Connected inventories. And it is connected. Um, so I can drag all my unrefined malarkey. Put it in there. Like that. We're really low on power. We've only got one turbine on the go. Yeah, I need storage. Damn it, I need a cargo container. I need to pop one up really quickly. What have we got in relation to cargo? We've got large. Interior plate, 360. I can't afford to build that at the moment. Small steel tube. Come on, come on, you bad boy. Look at us with our new storage. Let us put our things in. Things. It's nearly full already, though. I put my hydrogen bottle in there. I want that. Right. That's really struggling. We need a lot more power. A lot more power. I need a battery as well. That's what I need. But first of all, let's go and get the other things. Right. My old base is just a shell now. I have got everything out. All I need on my other base, all I need is an O2H2 generator. If I can make an O2H2 generator and a medical room, I can then grind this thing down. I don't need it anymore. Which will be amazing. We will be proper grown-ups. Yes. My batteries are going to go around the back on the floor here. I would like two so we can store lots of power. Build them in advance. G, but at to to battery. Yeah, put that there. I want the lighty things on the top. And I want two. It's a lighty thing on the top. Yes. So we need construction comps, power cells, computers. Production power cells. I'm going to go for 50. I don't know if I've got enough stuff. There. So at least now when we're not refining, we can turn... Fact. Let's go back to K. Turn our refinery on again now. Current input 690, current output 1 megawatt. So we're using more than we're getting at the moment, which means we need a lot more power. A lot more. I want to build a medical room as well, so yeah, we're going to have to do this first. Current input 1.27 megawatts, current output 561 kilowatts. So now we're making more than we're burning, which is great. We can proceed with the next step of buildy goodness. Um, let's finish this. Oh, sh my power cells should be finished. Yep. Full up with stuff and things, so I'm going to get rid of some of them. Pick them up, son. I 
I need three more. Oh, you have a laugh. And I've got two. Production. One of them. Now we got power for days. Well, that's still not a lot of power. I could chuck a couple of solar cells. Yes, chuck a couple of solar cells up. Yeah, solar cell. Easy to make. On a server, I would usually finish these blocks off. Um, it takes a lot, but these unfinished blocks will slow down a server. So, yeah, make sure you finish them off. But I'm only building a temporary base here because, like I said, I am building straight onto a capital ship. Which we're going to start. I might even start it this episode. I think I'm going to. I want the medical room finished. I want the O2H2 finished first. Medical room is going here. Kind of. I need interior plate, which we've got. So I can pop it in. There. O2H2 generator. That's not one of them. Um, O2. There it is. O2 H2 generator. We'll get rid of that. Look very similar, don't they? Let's have a look at our progression. Okay. We're doing well. We're doing well. We're getting there, son. Rotors. That's when I'll start blowing myself up. We do rotors and pistons. Alrighty then. Oh yeah, after that, after I've done the O2H2, I can build a cryo chamber, which is awesome. I just step into it and refuel everything. Mm, everything. Let's build this. I want this connected as well. However, we will be using conveyors at some point. So I'm just gonna slap it in here for now. I want the yellow bit forward so I can access it. I need lots of things and stuff. Let's go here. We were doing that, weren't we? So let's finish that. Bulletproof glass. I've got, I think. No, we haven't. Was that only four? Production. Search. Oh, it's there. Inventory, click. There. Apparently we're only getting two bars of the sun. Probably because of that. That will never change because I... Ah, I'll, I'll move my solar farm over there later. I think this is enough... Whoa, I'm bouncing. This is enough power to keep us going anyway. I need some of them. There. There. O2H2 generator. Where's my ice? Not that I'm short on ice at the moment. If I put that in there, I can do this. And now I can do this and this and fill them up. Beautiful. Interior plate. I still need more. Metal grid. Yeah. Interior plate. Med metal grid and we're making our medical Right, again, I'm sat about waiting for this, so what I'm going to do, I am going to save the game. Do you want to save your progress? Yes, I'm going to exit to main menu. I should have just saved there. I am going to go to load game. I am going to go to the sausage world. Edit settings. Uh, advanced. I'm going to go refinery speed times 10. Assembler of fish. Oh, I'm going to change that as well. Hmm. We might change our hostility at a later point as well. Does that only go to five? Oh, damn it. All right. Yep. Yeah, okay. And okay. And I'm going to go load. Now, this should be, like, nearly finished now. Yeah, it's done already. Cooked. It's not cheating because it's in the menu. You can make your game your own. Yes, you very can. Metal grid, I still need more. Production. More interior plate. However, 
I can use this now, even though it's not finished, it's functional. Yeah! I can strip down my little respawn base. There you go, my beautiful little base of love. And now at this, you can go in, press F, and I can change into my beautiful suits. Let's have a leopard skin hat as well. I haven't got the leopard skin gloves yet. I've got a badger suit. I've got the veteran suit complete. Should we be all serious and grown up for a little while? Let's do it. Let's see what we get. Badger grinder. Mmm. Oh yeah, you can change the look of your tools as well. You are so getting ground down. All gone. Okay. You have served us well, trusty little respawn pod. We are about to embark on a voyage. It might take a couple of goes to grind all this down. We're about to embark on a voyage of sausagey goodness in the Space Engineers. This is where it gets real. It should, yeah, should just drop the resources. Survival kit is gone. Now this is it. This is all that remains. We are on our own. We are officially on our own. That is it. I'm going to leave this deck here just because I don't want to grind it all down. Yep. We are now entering a world of survivally sausageness. We'll get through this. We will get through this. In fact, I'm not even going to call this a base, because it's not a base. I'm going to rename it the Holding Platform. Because that's all it is to us. Just a mere holding platform. Holding Platform 1. Yeah. Right, now what we're going to do is I'm going to need some more steel plate. That is going to be stage one. Construction comp and motors. We might as well grab them. Look at the size. This is going to be huge. I don't know how to do this. Is it T? Snap to grid? I don't know. I won't. Oh, I can just plop it on the floor, can't I? Now, if I build that, will it just do the grown-up thing and go on the floor? No, that's not where I want that. Um, I think what I might have to do is actually, because it needs to be powered. I don't want this to disappear. Disappear? Disappear. I think, in fact, we're going to need blocks in there. So I'm going to put that there. I'm going to connect this to our holding pad. Right, I have found an issue, an immediate issue. Now I've been on the Steam forum -y thing, and it said to do this, so I'm going to try it. One, two, three, four. Um, put this here, like this. And then it said, simply delete this. There. That worked for me. That worked like a charm. <laughs> Thank you, Steam Thing. And now we can get to building the daddy ship. Our first block is placed. This is, this is make or break this. This is either going to work or it's not. 
But, yeah, let's see what we see. I don't want it monstrous. This landing gear is going to get chopped off at the end. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, does that look in proportion? No, I'm going to go eight. Seven, eight. That is going to be the size of my ship. I think that's enough for one episode. I have thoroughly enjoyed myself. The plot thickens. This should be very interesting. We've got power. Any top tips, give me a shout. You've given me some fantastic tips on both the live streams and the videos so far. This is getting serious now. Let's get this going. All right, if you did enjoy it, give us a like and a subscribe. Massive thank you to all my patrons who enable me to carry on doing this. If you have subscribed, don't forget to ring the little bell. I'll see you soon. Laters.